Hello and welcome to Absurdly Epic's Word of the Day. I'm just in time and your word of the day is beguile. Beguile means to influence by trickery, flattery, etc. Mislead. Delude, to take away from by cheating or deceiving. Now let's go through some of the standout synonyms. Our first word is cheat, which I think is darker than I imagined this word going. Not that this is a hugely dark word, however, I thought it meant something more along the lines of mystify when I used it in a poem. But no, it's a bit more negative than that. And next we have the word bluff, which I like because of that scene in The Princess Bride where Miracle Max won't revive the hero because he thinks he wants to come back to life to blave, which of course means to bluff. But that's not really what he said. He said true love, but he didn't hear him right. Next, we have hoodwink, which is a nice, innocent, and fun word that I think everyone can appreciate. And lastly, we have flimflam, which is a word that I just really like. I first remember hearing the word in the 1990s movie The Mummy with Brendan Fraser. That's probably not word originated, but I think it was more popular back in the early 1900s. But hey, you could make a hashtag out of it. And now for my favorite time of the day, rhyme of the day. Rhyme of the day is basically what it sounds like. I take the word of the day and I rhyme it. And then I give you a phrase using that rhyme. It really is that simple. And here we go. As you know, the word of the day is beguile. And the word I chose to rhyme with it is style. And our phrase is this one time I was gonna be guile, but after looking it up, I found it's not my style. And now we've reached the end of our journey, so I would like you to comment below. Um, maybe you could throw in the word of the day somewhere in your comments, uh, or use my rem day or come up with a better rhyme of the day of your own um also while you're down there hit the like button subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and hit the little bell because that's important too apparently um you can also visit my website absurdlyepic.com where you can find my poetry books or even read samples from my poetry books for free so I'm going to leave you to it. All right. Well, take care, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.